Paul, such an honor to meet you. Thank, Thank you for you. joining us on iHeartRadio. So going through archives. iHeartRadio, uh, my podcast is on iHeartRadio. You Radio. betcha it is. <laughs> <laughs> and it's great. Thank and you. thank you so much. Congratulations. Going through all the archives of footage, was there a piece of footage that maybe you hadn't seen in a while that was a pleasant surprise to go, come across again? Good question. Um, yeah, cathartic in, in a lot of cases. For sure. uh, finding the old footage of my family, uh, finding the footage, uh, footage of when I lived in Vegas. Yes, uh, probably so, a lot of fun stuff there. <laughs> right, uh, a lot of the uh, Sinatra stuff. Mm -hmm. So it was kind of eclectic as to uh, the kind of stuff that I said, wow, what are you going to come up with? Because there's warehouses and all I kinds bet. of stuff they had to deal with for a good year. Was there something that maybe you learned about Paul that maybe you hadn't known going into it that kind of surprised you? Well, you know, I, early on I found the, the Canadian film, okay. uh, Lonely Boy, that was yep. made in 1962, I believe. And that blew me away. Because uh, what you see in that film is, is that moment in Paul's life when he has to figure out how to have longevity, right? How to break through the teen model and go right. into become an adult, you know, entertainer. And um, so it was that nexus, seeing that young Paul. Because in that footage, you see the fully formed Paul. He's 20 years old, right. and he's running the show backstage. He's doing. He's changing the tunes in the middle of it, and that's who I spent a year and a half with. Was that guy? But he was fully formed by the age of 20. And we talk a lot about that off camera too, and I think it has a lot to do with being Canadian. Because he because he went to America, and he felt like the other. He always felt like he was a little bit on the outside. Right. And the U.S. is great for that kind of stuff, the underdog, and and it made him really work hard. He had an incredible work ethic. And he combined that with the great talent. So there was just so many things that, that I learned about Paul. But just being with him, I mean, you'll see, he just, you know, he's just, he's like a force of nature. Oh, one of a kind, for sure. And last thing quickly before sure. we go, how happy are you to see good friend and former collaborator Celine Dion coming back and, and making a comeback with her music? Well, I go way back with Celine, for way sure. back with Renee. Uh, experienced what she's going through in terms of just a friend and wondering how she's going to pull out of it. Uh, look, you always wish your friends well. I think that hopefully she's on her feet and can do it. Yes. And nobody will know better than her because she's a professional and she's great at what she does. And as are you. So congratulations. Thank you. And when did your friendship begin with him? What kind of made you want to take this project on? Absolutely. You know, I met Paul about two years ago okay. at the Polo Lounge at the Beverly Hills Hotel. Nice. We had set, my agent set up a lunch. And he had been interviewing directors. So m much of it was that I was chosen, in a way, to do it. Okay. Um, and part of that is, that's classic Paul. I mean, he really had an idea of what he wanted to do and who he wanted to tell a story. And it really was about trust. Um, and you'd have to ask him what took him over the edge. I'll but make we sure I follow that up. <laughs> we talked a lot about music. He knew I was a musician. I got the songwriting aspect of it. Um, and then, um, yeah, we just kind of hit it off. I mean, he's, he's a character. And... Um, I think I think that helped us sort of. Uh, I'm also I'm kind of a I'm an Italian American from from New right. York, so we have that. He kind needed of edge. another character exactly. to tell his story. Exactly. A little awesome. bit. I think that helped. All right. Well, congratulations. So nice to meet nice you. To meet Thank you. you. Yeah. Thank you so much. Have fun. Pleasure. Thank you. Pleasure.